Kia ora, I'm Nathan Penny. Last week I was on the road meeting with farmers down in South Canterbury and Otago. And it was good to catch up with, with so many. And one of the hot to topics of conversation while I was speaking with farmers was runaway inflation. Indeed, while I was away, we had the latest inflation data and they showed that annual inflation in the September quarter was running at 7.2%. That was effectively unchanged from the June quarter, where inflation printed at 7.3%. Importantly, it didn't fall. We had expected inflation to come in under 7%, and other analysts, and importantly, the Reserve Bank, had also thought that it would too. Also, when we look or dig into the inflation data, we saw that some of the core measures, the ones that exclude volatile items like fuel, were also continuing to run red hot. That means that the Reserve Bank has more to do to tame the inflation beast, and that means higher interest rates. On that basis, we now expect the Reserve Bank to lift the OCR, or official cash rate, to a peak of 5%, whereas previously we had thought 45 And to get there, we expect a bumper 75 basis point hike in next month, followed by another 50 basis points in February and 25 in April. Eventually though, we do expect the Reserve Bank will get on top, top of inflation, and once it's confident it has, it will start to lower the official cash rate, but that's not likely until the second half of 2024. So for now, for farmers, it means higher interest rates and higher borrowing costs. Talk to you next time. Kaki te ano.